Hi there, สวัสดีครับ You are watching Dr. Green Channel, and now we are going to show you the demonstration of the automatic voltage stabilizer uh, 5 kVA from Dr. Green. So let's see uh, the voltage adjustment on the back. I have connect the fan uh, with the stabilizer, which on the screen we can see the IP is represent the input voltage. Uh, now is about 99 volt and the output is now about 199 volt. So uh, this is how uh, we are going to uh, show you because uh, let's see in front on the switch we have uh, set and switch on only the stabilizer. So let's see from the beginning. So for example, uh, we can assume that this stabilizer have just uh, finished installation, uh, which the detail has been uh, show you in the previous video. So once you finish the installation, you have check all the hardware installation. Uh, everything has been uh, installed properly. So we will power on this stabilizer. So this this switch on the right hand side is the stabilizer uh, breaker and on the left hand side uh, for this one is the bypass switch which is only used when the stabilizer have some problem or uh, you want to do some maintenance or for this stabilizer and this bypass the bypass switch has been uh, inbuilt in this stabilizer so you don't need to buy uh, the bypass switch from somewhere else all right it's very uh, worth for your money and okay let's see i will uh, power on this stabilizer so the way to turn on is only single switch the microprocessor will start to check the incoming uh, voltage the incoming input voltage and after that, it will, uh, if it is still in the support voltage range, it will start working. All right, so the output is about 200 volt for now. So uh, you will see the fan uh, at the back is start to operate and the fan is on now. So you, you, you will get like a strong wind because it has been uh, adjusted from the about 100 volt uh, to be uh, the output let's see the output about 199 volt and if uh, the incoming input voltage is increasing to about 120 volt you will get the the, the output about 139 or something so uh, this is still uh, the, the voltage range that we can see uh, if we live in a city is probably about 134 to 100 and sorry 234 and 235 36 something all right so let's see the input if uh, the input voltage is about 120 so we can see the output voltage is about 200 and something okay so now the incoming uh, voltage is is about 132 so we can see the the output voltage now is about 220 so i think uh in the most case when our customer uh using the stabilizer we can see the the, the voltage incoming incoming uh, input voltage might be about 100 to 140 130 uh, something like this uh, except in some uh, special festival or the long weekend uh, that everyone go back to the hometown then uh, we might see uh, the particular uh, lower uh, for the incoming input voltage so this stabilizer still can help to manage when that uh, special uh, event uh, occur or coming and let's see if the input voltage is about 158 or 59 we still can uh, got the very good uh, output voltage we still working very well uh, you can see the fan speed is still turn very strong so let's see the the output uh, 
when we when we test for the for the high voltage the incoming high voltage okay the output is adjust and reduce uh, by the stabilizer so we can see 266 uh, coming voltage and the output is is adjust to be uh, reduced or lower to be uh, 230 something so uh, this is the the demos demonstration of the step automatic uh, voltage stabilizer and this can uh, help to adjust very quick uh, according to the incom incoming input voltage and thanks for the uh, micro uh, processor base uh, for this stabilizer and this stabilizer also uh, certified with the ISO 9001 so you can trust on the quality of the product and this has been used across India and especially also uh, in Thailand the working temperature is very uh, strong for this uh, stabilizer which uh, can work from the 0 degree Celsius to 50 uh, degree Celsius because uh, this is the indoor so uh, beware to install in the indoor and in the place where the wind is can uh, flow uh, very well so don't uh, install in the closed environment because uh, this still need uh, to be uh, cooled by the, the, the natural uh, air cooling okay so let's see uh, the working scenario when uh, we are going to uh, turn on the bypass switch. For example, we, we want to do something or the, do some maintenance of uh, this stabilizer. So I adjust the, the voltage uh, to be uh, like 200 something for the input and I power off this stabilizer. So what happened if I uh, turn on the bypass switch let's see now the fan is 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 turning on so the appliances are in your home still working as normal but it will connect directly from the main supply to the appliances or the uh, control box or the the circuit breaker or the consumer box uh, so uh, the, the stabilizer will not work because we turn this breaker in the off position okay let's see when I uh, turn off the bypass switch so if I turn off the bypass switch uh, the fan is also stop working or the the fan is power off so uh, the bypass switch Again, this is coming uh, with the stabilizer, so you don't need to go out to buy somewhere else. And in the normal uh, scenario, so you just turn on this switch, only one single switch over here, which is the circuit breaker for the stabilizer. And turn the bypass switch off in the off position. Then the fan is now working. So this is uh, the de demonstration session uh, for the automatic voltage st stabilizer 5 kVA from Dr. Green. If you have any question or uh, any doubt, uh, just feel free to uh, reach us or contact us at the in contact information below of this video. Thank you very much for watching and stay tuned with uh, our channel. So if you like this video, uh, give us the thumbs up or uh, put the subscribe button and share uh, this video with your friends to encourage our team uh, to produce or shooting the, the, the other uh, interesting video or other uh, excited uh, video. All right. So uh, once again, uh, Stay tuned and thanks uh, for watching. See you again in the next video. Thank you. Thank you.